Hello friends, and from this video you will learn why you should not throw away old plastic bottles. And what useful of them can be done for your garden. To make life easier for yourself and thereby improve the comfortable life for your garden crops. Let's talk about drip irrigation. Because for plants this is the main thing. If you do not set up the correct watering, do not do drip irrigation, then no top dressing and shaping will give you the desired effect. Namely, getting a big harvest. I will show on the example of open ground and the cultivation of cucumbers in it. These are varietal cucumbers, I grow them without a trellis, they weave along the ground. I plant them in a circle, pour water into the center, and let the lashes go in different directions. And we face the following problem when growing without drip irrigation. When watering, we pour water here, and it spreads on the sides, but does not penetrate the roots. And to create drip irrigation, we need a plastic bottle with a volume of at least 4 pints. We also need reinforcement or thick wire. As they say who has what. You can even just use wooden sticks. They should be 8 inches longer than the bottle itself. First you need to tighten the cork tightly and attach metal bars to it, as in my case. I do it with tape. Note how I fix the top and bottom. The top needs to be wrapped with tape so that our future legs on which the bottle will be held rest against the tape and do not pop out. And I wrap the lower part closer to the neck itself. Now you can cut off the bottom of the bottle so that it is convenient to fill it with water. You can already leave the design like that. But I have already tested it and just when the cork is unscrewed, water stops flowing out over time, due to clogging. So I came up with the following. It is necessary to make small holes with a depth of approximately 3 mm in the neck itself using a soldering iron or a knife. This is necessary so that the cork, even when fully tightened, still passes water. Thus, under the pressure of water, drops will slowly flow down the cork. Now I install the structure on the bed and fill it with water. As you can see, drip irrigation immediately starts working. Such a bottle will last from 2 to 5 hours of watering, and if you take a larger bottle, then it will last for a day. What gives us such watering? It would seem that you can just take cucumbers from a watering can and pour them over and not bother. But as I showed all the water flows past, and the land where watering was from a watering can, after drying, is taken with a crust. But with such drip irrigation, the water will slowly pass into the depths of the soil and moisten this whole circle. Where is the root system of cucumbers? And another plus from this design is that you will always know where the roots of the cucumbers are. While they are still small, this can be seen, and so, but when they grow, it will be difficult to understand where to pour water. And so you will always pour water exactly under the root. You can install it not only for watering cucumbers, but also for peppers, tomatoes, eggplant and zucchini. With such watering, the plants will easily endure even the strongest heat and will not wither. They will grow quickly and bear fruit profusely. So friends to whom the information from this video was useful, like it. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. And also subscribe to my channel. So as not to miss the release of new videos. I wish you a good day. See you in new videos.